Try to see it my way Do I have to keep on talking till I can go on While you see it your way Run the risk of knowing that our love may soon be gone Okay <clears throat> Well, I'm back in there and uh, sitting on the top of a tower um, people had asked me, or s uh, several people have asked me about what happened with Newt, and to be quite honest, everything that I would say about it would be complete speculation. I, uh, we made up after, we had a fight, okay, and I had had a half about him not spending any time with me, and, um, he got kind of ticked off about that, and I guess he was feeling pressured by me. Although, really, I don't really feel like I was pressuring him at all. I felt like I was being quite understanding and um, patient because he had gotten a new job and didn't have very much time to be with me anymore. So, this one night, I really, really, really wanted to be with him. I wanted to talk to him and all that. And so I had, um, I, I had a huff and I yelled at him about it. And then we made up from that and said, could we just erase that? And he said, sure. And then about a week after that, he just stopped talking to me. And the really weird thing about that is that a long, long time ago, he had made a promise never to do that. That if we ever stopped talking, there would be an explanation of it. Apparently, he doesn't really feel like he's bound by that promise. Oh well. So, so yeah, I've been in a depression, and there's still um, times when I get lonely and blue, and I cry and all that, but I'm getting over it, and... At this point, I really don't want to talk to him. I thought about, you know, demanding an explanation and all that crap, but really, you know, he's being an asshole. And he'll just try to turn it around to where it's all Nalora's fault, and I really don't want to play that game with him anymore. So, uh, I've just decided that if he doesn't want to speak to me, fine. The really weird thing is, is that, you know, he can spy on me. He knows where I'm at. He knows, uh, you know, I'm very vocal, I'm very, I'm out there, I, I'm not hidden anywhere. So, uh, you know, he could be spying on me all the time, stalking me, you know, to see what is happening with me. And he gets to get his jollies and his uh, mind set at ease that I'm okay, but I don't have the same privilege, which is another thing that's quite cruel about it, you know, and another thing that makes him quite a butthole. So, uh, anyway, he can be a butthole if he wants, and uh, I'll be a nice person, like I am. And so that's really all I came in to say. I just wanted to explain that. And I wanted to do it with my avatar, since, uh, you know, I didn't want you to have to look at an ashtray and a smoking cigarette. <laughs> so I'm getting better day by day. I still have weepy periods, but... Um, a little bit better today, and things are not as bad as uh, they were. And that's all I have to say. So, bye.